I think so too because it's very unstable. Oh, she just lost a quarter off the tower. Hey, hey, some are coming out of the bottom. Some are coming out of the bottom. Oh, check it out. It's, it's dissolving. It's dissolving without doing anything. Oh, mystery bag. Sherry and John here for We Play You, you win. win. We have a game today that was suggested by our, our viewer, Gene S. And what we're going to do is we're going to acknowledge that it is autumn here in the United States where we are. And every autumn, school kids collect leaves for school to do a pressed collection of leaves. And we're going to collect leaves. This is a tree trunk here full of leaves, but... In the back there, we're, we're going to try and get, I want more leaves than John, John wants more leaves than me, but there's a rake back on the pusher shelf, and when the rake makes it through the play field into the chute, game's over. So here we go, I'm playing first, and look at that really full mystery bag on top of the tree. John, how can our viewers win that mystery bag? Well, hey, today, listen listen for our mystery bag question. We'll ask you sometime during today's video, and we'll ask you to reply with a comment with the correct answer. In terms of how long you have to provide that comment, please check out our website, weplayyouwin.com, for all of the rules and details. John's turn. Oh, the worst description. Yeah, just check our website, weplayyouwin.com. All of the rules are up there. Now, not all of the U.S. has four seasons. When I was in middle school, my family moved to Florida, and that was the end of collecting all the leaves to me because they don't have four seasons. Oh, I want to keep the scent pieces just fell on the left hand side, and when that hits the root cam, it could be ugly. It could be. Talk okay. About a disaster. Waiting for John's. Push to stop. Okay, my turn. I'm playing down the middle because I want to take that tree trunk down. Let's see. Is it going to happen? Let's see if we can knock that tower down. Oh, that's that tree down. It's a tree. It's a tree. I want to collect. I want to get my leaf collection going here. Hold on. Let's, here comes my push. Oh, the tree is moving. Hold on. I got another little push here. And that's it for me, John's turn. All right, now when I was a kid, I used to collect leaves. I think uh, many of us did here. You used to collect leaves too, right, Sherry? Well, yes, we had to for school, but also sometimes you'd just see a beautiful leaf and go collect it in the book. Yeah, I, I had a leaf, ooh, I had a leaf collection and I had a scrapbook collection. Uh, a collection of scrapbooks? Well, no, but uh, I had a scrapbook for newspaper clippings and other cool things like that. I had a scrapbook. I don't think kids do that anymore because who has magazines and newspapers? Now everything's online now. Well, we still get some magazines. We get The Strand, which is mystery stories, and ukulele magazines. Yeah? Oh, that was a cool flip. Let's see if we can get that tree down. Come on, tree. Oh, this... well, at least the rake is staying back there. That's jinx, jinx, jinx. All right, here we go. I'm playing down the middle again. I want to move, move this structure into the tree so we can knock it down and start the game. Looks like a locomotive. Chugga, chugga, choo, choo. Here comes the rake tree. Everything's going to the sides. This does not go well. No, that, that rake is riding high and proud. Well, as long as it stays there, you don't get that chance. rake on the play field until the tree goes down. No. Oh, another push. Okay, I'm going to play over on the left because there's a deck of cards behind the tower, the tree. And. I don't want it sliding out like it is. I'm trying to skew it out. Oh, we got a little nudge on that tree. It's moving. Let's see what we can do here. Okay. In the middle. And here comes oh, my push. Of, just look at that deck of cards. It's just hanging there like a yeah. plank or something. 
Well, there's a deck of cards directly behind the tree that wants to shift the wrong way. We need to play on the left and push it back behind the tree. But some of us aren't going to do that. We're only cooperative until the tree goes down. Okay, we both need that tree to go down. If the rake gets out, oh man. How did the dice all end up as ones? Did you do that? It was set up to be pretty. I'm the OCD person. No, no, no. It's not a called OCD. It's CDO. It's like OCD, but the letters are in the correct order. My turn. Yeah. Let me make sure that your push is done. It appears to be done. I'm playing on the left because I want that deck of cards. I think it's just it was playing left. I think it's going to just continue to rotate around the tree playing left. Give me a push, give me a push. Oh, Aww. come on. That's all I'm getting. Five dollars with the quarters. That's all I got. And that structure is just standing. It's not wanting to go off that pusher show. Uh, we always take turns. I play five dollars. John oh, plays five dollars. It's going to go. Oh, that we're knocked down that tractor. That's come quite on. the tractor. Oh, it's going to go. Oh, this will be cool. Oh. Oh, yes. Yes. Perfect. Oh! It, didn't it stood up! Oh my goodness! There are two decks of cards jamming into it. Two silver strikes up against it. And now the rake is actually going to try and move down. So the clock is ticking. Oh man. Alright Sherry, hmm. your turn. What do I dislike more? Argonauts or stuck time? Hmm, I don't know. <laughs> the Argonauts are awesome! I don't know. The claymation was fantastic. Oh, oh, here we go. Oh! oh! Chimney Christmas. Oh! <laughs> it's, it's wiggling. Oh. It's gonna burst. Hold on, here comes What's the rest that? of my... <laughs> wait, wait, wait! My turn is still going. Oh! Okay, it's John's turn. What in the world? Oh, 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 I didn't have to do anything. Here we go. It's got to fall. Come on. What a tease. Oh. You can get those. You know, one of those dice will do it. Oh, that one won't. What the heck? <laughs> oh, here we go. What? Okay, we've got to get that silver strike to go down. That's what we're doing. we got to <laughs> not let that rake come off that pusher shelf. Can't let that oh, off. here we go, here we go, here we go. You are kidding me. Your turn, Sherry. You are kidding me. Okay, I'm putting right down the middle. I want that silver strike to go down. I don't want that rake move. Stay put, rake. Stay. That is one sturdy. Okay, oh, here we go. What the? <laughs> wow. I can't believe it. The whole bottom of the tower is flared out. Like it's bursting. What oh, could be going on John's here? Turn. Oh, jeez. Must be an oak tree. I think the trolls are involved somehow. I hope not. It's gotta be those zero coin pusher trolls. Unbelievable. How is this? Oh, oh. oh, don't fall on top, don't fall on top. Oh my goodness. Oh, here we go. You're kidding me! It didn't fall! <laughs> it's my turn. Knock it down, Sherry. Knock it down. Hmm. Keep playing rightish. Center right, I think. And unbelievable. Uh, well, we got some loot. What do we got? We 
got a hundred thousand dollars. All right, it's John's I'm playing time. very cautiously. Can get that tree to start falling. I'm staying rightish. I want to fill out my leaf collection. I love pressing leaves. I haven't done it. I think the last thing I we pressed was some rose petals. Yes. Um, we, my favorite thing to press is four leaf clovers, and we have found zero four leaf clovers. I've been living in this state for over two decades, and in over two decades, I have never found a four leaf clover. And I have lived in the Midwest United States, I have lived in, in the Southeast, and I have never had trouble finding a four leaf clover. If I wanted to find one, by golly, I could find one, but not in this state, we're in the Northwest. Those clovers don't seem to want to lift it. Oh! And I think they're, I'm still thinking we've got to play right. I think so too, because it's very unstable. Oh, she just lost a quarter off the tower. Hey, hey, some are coming out of the bottom. Some are coming out of the bottom. Oh, check it out, it's, it's dissolving. It's dissolving without doing anything. Oh! bag and I see leaves. It still isn't what we need to have to know. That is a hefty mystery bag. Probably oh, our oh. regular viewers know what's in that mystery bag. I this bet. might be a one leaf contest. It could happen. We can win by one leaf. But that mystery bag is so full it looks like a bag of leaves, doesn't it? It does. Now we get to go Jump in that pile of leaves. All right, Sharon, go for it. Okay. Oh, oh! We got two down. It's leaning. It's leaning. And it's on the right. One of us can actually get those leaves this time. Not this time, but eventually. There we oh. go! Woo! Yeah! Oh, my goodness. Whoa! Oh, my right. Now the game is on. We both need to finish our assignment, but only one of us will come out on top. Oh, silver strike. And knowing my luck, that's going to be you, babe, because you've been like winning game after game that's after not game. That's I, I totally is. I can't remember the last I time I won. Either. Well, like the first 20 games we played, you won them all. So. Beginner's luck. Hmm. Oh. Oh. Wow. I love the <laughs> moon. That came so, shooting out the machine. All right. It did. Hold up, hold up. It's still my turn. Here comes a push. Oh, wow. That and is a, that's it. John's turn. That's a turn. huge mess. We got to clear out this right now. Don't All right. let the rake come off the push shot. I'm playing right. Yeah, the oh, the 50 cents are about to roll off. Oh, that is going to be a big You game. look in the left and you can see them right there on the ledge. Okay, will it get stuck? This is the first time we've had them in the machine. We've never had 50 cent pieces in here. Oh, uh, it's just... Bounce out, smack Sherry in the foot, with the wedge in the prize shoot. Unknown. Oh, gonna it's going to be loud, though, I'll bet you. Oh, yeah. Especially if it hits me in the foot. Well, let's hope it doesn't. I know. Okay, that's the end of your push. Okay, my turn, right? Go for it. Oh okay. no, one bolt behind the rake. Well, not by design. Oh, I'm playing all the way to the right. They're just, they have a mind of their own sometimes. Mm. You know what I was watching today? I don't know. The Three Stooges. Woohoo! Yep, 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 yep. Oh, yep, yep, yep. Yep, yep, yep. And I was thinking about, you know, oh, Nelly. We got a Bitcoin, and another Bitcoin, and another Bitcoin. But you know what? That doesn't help me with my assignment. And another Bitcoin, and, oh, a roll of half dollars. Oh, what was that? Three students. Oh, wow. 
I missed the Bitcoin somehow. There's no Bitcoin. Everybody always will ask, you know, who's your favorite stooge? My turn. I'm playing on the right. They always say, you know, who's your favorite? Mo, Larry, or Curly? And I have to say none of the above because I'm a shemp person. I like shemp the best. Now, I know there also there was Joe Besser, but God bless him. He tried. But what can you do? You're trying to squeeze into an established back. doesn't really work. But Shemp, Shemp's the man. Your turn, John. You know, I... I Where's your stooge, John? I, the stooges were not a part of my childhood, I'm sorry to say. Where I'm I grew not a up, child. I still like the stooges. I hear you. We're just, they were never... They, before I met you, I was stoogeless. How's that? Well, I find it interesting that... You know, the stooges... Oh, $10,000. The They're spreading out. Nip, nip, nip. The stooges were nip, nip, nip. You know, when Rena was little, she said to karate class. And there's a move where you you take your fingers and poke somebody like in the eyes, like the stooges do. It's called nookie tag. Oh, I thought that was just hilarious. <laughs> you mean the stooges move is called nookie tag? Nip, nip, nip. That's awesome. Legit, I'm not making that up, John. Knock, knock. Who's there? Jinx. Oh, she didn't fall for it. I tried, guys. All right. The other day, Sherry jinxed me really, really good. <laughs> she had me jinx for quite a while. I couldn't say anything. My attempt here was way too obvious. Mm -hmm. And now she's thinking, how can I jinx him? So... We'll see what happens. No, but I, I do have a joke. Well, let's hear it. What did the grape say when the elephant stepped on it? Uh, get off of me, you're too big. No, nothing. You just let out a little wine. Yeah. Okay. Wow. John got the silver stripe and a hundred thousand. And it's your turn. And you still have a quarter in your hand. I just have no, I don't. Oh. Okay. He already grabbed his quarters for the next turn. Okay. Ding, ding, ding. Wow, they have spread out all the way across. That's what I was the saying there. Yeah. It's going to be all open. And that rake is close behind. And. I still a little push coming. Wow. Okay, what did I get? Oh, wow. $100,000. I'm starting my turn. Now, as a kid, we always had a bunch of leaves that needed to be raked up. And I got to tell you, I really wasn't, I didn't enjoy it a whole lot. But. Why not? I did like raking other people's yards, just not my own. I don't know what it was. Something about helping somebody else was more enter entertaining or helpful as a kid than just raking my own yard. Well, I loved raking because you can make piles and you can jump in them and make leaf angels. You know, lay down and make oh. angels in the leaves. My favorite way to rake the leaves was just mow it up with a lawnmower. Well, we had a thing... It was a lawn sweeper thing, and you'd push it. You'd push it like a lawnmower, but it wasn't powered. It was hey, yeah, 50 cent stack is moving. So the other one already came up. Yeah. Here comes a little push. I loved that thing, because it would be like, you just walk behind it like a lazy person, and it would sweep up a whole bag of leaves. Yeah, that's it. I can see that being fun. We have a sidewalk sweeper like that now. We do. You just walk along and it has it has circular brushes and it sweeps the sidewalk and it's like the laziest way possible to have a nice swept sidewalk. I love that thing. The mystery bag is getting ready to tumble. It's gonna clog up the works. <laughs> okay. Oh, this is still your push, John. Gotta ways till the leaves are okay, out. Okay, my turn. Oh, 
Well, I also liked burning leaves. What? Who doesn't like burning leaves? Well, talk about motivation to rake leaves. That's true. You throw them in a big barrel. Yeah. Oh, we didn't. We didn't have a barrel. We just had a big. Well, it depended. It depended on who's yard fire. I was If I was doing my Aunt Rita's house, there's a barrel. But if we were doing our land, it was just a big fire, it's like a bonfire type of thing. Yeah, that's kind of how we did it too. We had a, in our case, we had a big dog run and we'd pile all the leaves and sticks and stuff. Oh, whoa! That is one heck of a thing. Oh, more oh, stuff to me. This is so dangerous. There's 100,000 oh, oh, and 10,000. I'm scared to reach in there. Your turn, hold darling. Hold on. And there's, there's a silver stripe. Whoa! This is like Christmas. And a 10,000. Whoa, and that I'll mystery bag. That. Someone's going to win that mystery bag. Now I'm playing on the right. There's no point in playing on the left until we have to. That's right. You'll notice some of these game pieces say minus one, minus two. Those are penalties. Those are penalties. Don't want those. Green is good. Red is not good in this game. Hold on, do I get another push? No, I don't. John's turn. Now, in my leaf collection as a kid, I, one of my favorite leaves to collect, and it's weird to say favorite leaves to collect because you usually only have one or two of any kind of leaf. But what I really liked were catalpa tree leaves. These That's leaves okay. here kind of remind me of them, only much smaller. <laughs> Those catalpa trees are huge, they're giant they're not softwood. Big as your head. Yeah, and they have these giant seed pods that are, the tree has as well. Don't they flower cool. also? Yeah, I think they do. But the trees were always so big, I don't yeah, remember they're the massive, flowers. Yeah, they're massive, massive trees. finding the leaves as a kid in my uh, grandparents' house. My favorite technique for raking leaves, I like to you know, put a big tarp on the ground and rake them onto the big tarp. Take the most huge, huge, massive amounts of leaves more easily. Oh yeah. The lazy way. Lazy way is the best. Hold on, wait, wait, wait. I think you got all your pushes. You don't know. Okay, now it's your turn. Alright, working on the right. Because I see a leaf on the right that's getting close to falling. Yep. And I want that leaf for me. There yes. Goes. My first leaf. You got a leaf. Oh I'm so proud of my leaf now. Oh. It's a lovely brown leaf. Yeah, usually when I collected leaves, they were Probably green, for yes. You were looking for green leaves? I was looking for live leaves that I could press and preserve in that state. Oh, I was looking for like the sugar maple leaves. And they'd be There's like my first leaf. Fluorescent orange or, or neon yellow, or they'd be like crimson red. I love those, and I really love like walking to school and looking up and seeing the canopy of maple leaves, all those crazy colors. It was like so, it didn't seem real. Well, we, where we live now, we live in a place that's called the Treasure Valley, which comes with push. That's not the interesting part. Your turn, John. The, the heart of the Treasure Valley is this. Gosh, maybe not the heart, but the Boise, city. Idaho, the biggest city in Idaho is Boise, and it's known as the City of Trees. And uh, it's really beautiful this time of year when all the leaves, all the deciduous trees are turning colors, and you can look across the entire valley and just see all the colors. Oh it's, it's really kind of cool, especially like right at the beginning, you can kind of watch one tree turn. Yellow. And the next day there's three of them. Yeah, it just it goes across the valley. Three. It's really cool. Oh, I might get that 50 cent stack. There's no bonus points for you. It's cool. Well, I don't, oh, my, I don't get it. Your turn. I don't have my hand in there when it goes. Oh, I think you're going to get it, though, if you play right. You kind of playing middle. I see that. Good move. 
Oh, that's a nice push. Oh, it's falling backwards. Oh, there goes, oh, the, there rake. goes the rake. It's bound to happen. Look at that 50 cent stack. It's just. It's halfway. He it doesn't want to go. Halfway up the edge. Oh, that thing wow. must be heavy. Those, those rolls are heavy. Oh, yeah, they are. Oh, I see another leaf. You see it? Whoa! Careful. Now it is safer to reach in there. It's another. Let's see. John F. Kennedy. Oh, I want to get that leaf that's right there on the edge. Let me get it. Oh, no, they're falling the wrong direction for me. Oh, oh there's a, a good nice push. push. Oh, unbelievable. Oh, I just handed Sherry that leaf. No, you've got a nice... Okay. Nope, it's yours. That's going to be yours. Hmm, maybe. I'm going to go for it. Now, is this the kind of assignment you would have loved doing in school? Absolutely. Outside? The only problem is I'm easily distracted, so I'd start out on a mission for and you end up climbing the tree. Maybe climbing a tree or jumping off someone's oh, garage. It didn't go. I'm not done pushing. Oh, there you go. Whoa! Oh, I'm scared to reach in here. I got a lovely yellow leaf. I got ah! a troll. I told you the trolls were involved. I, got 10, I told you. I told you. Another hundred thousand. And a deck of bicycle playing cards. I knew there were trolls involved in this catastrophe tonight. I don't even know where that troll came from. I don't even like trolls. How did that happen? That was amazingly sneaky on the trolls' part. So I Sharon told you Dillard. Yesterday that there was one missing. Sharon Dillard, that troll. Did you send that troll, Sharon? Sharon Dillard's one of our viewers, and she's made multiple comments on uh, enjoying the trolls, so I bet she sent that troll. Could be. Okay, my turn. I'm playing right down the middle. But I would get distracted. Oh, big push. I'd start out with the best of intentions. <laughs> And, oh, here comes a push. Is that it, is that it for my push? That's, that's it. it, your turn. Now, this is the kind of assignment though, If it, I mean, I have my own leaf collection. So I would have tried to finagle a deal with the teacher to just let me use my existing leaf collection instead of having to get a new one. Because you want to have one leaf collection, you don't want to have a dozen. Well, after we moved to Florida, I was the kid who would bring in weird creatures to my class for credits. Oh yeah, what did you bring? A tiny alligator turtle. Okay. You know they bite when they're tiny too. Yes, I, I imagine they do. And uh, what else did we get? Mm, oh, bitty bitty baby ringneck snakes. And of course little lizards. Well, Florida's full of all kinds of cool reptiles oh, yeah. and amphibians. Did you ever run into any poisonous frogs out there on your own? Not poisonous frogs, but poisonous snakes. So. Coral snake. You gotta be careful where you go swimming in Florida. You do. We got gators. Hold on. We got one coin fell into the Oh, another push for you. No just leaves. quarters, just quarters. It's John Stern. All right, I'm back on the right. I really want to get that plus three off on the right. And underneath it, there's another leaf. Yep. And I want to add to my collection. Maybe I should start collecting leaves again. I haven't collected leaves since I was a kid. We had a press kit that was, you know, wooden things. And, and yeah, I believe we still have, have the press kit. Well, we totally could do that. You can socially distance and collect leaves, no problem. That's right. And it's the season to collect colors right now. Oh, yeah. Oh, I only got two quarters left. <laughs> One. I really want that. 
I don't think it's in, in, gonna happen oh, for me. Push for you. I think this is gonna be sure. Here's your push. Here's your push. Not okay. for me. Hmm. I'm gonna play the left. You're playing the rake. Those have to get played over there too. Oh, you're gonna try to force it over on the right. Nice. Hmm. Okay, let's see what happens. Oh, I'm actually gonna get a little push. Yeah, a little. And wah, wah, it did wah. move slightly to the right, but what would the what would the stooges say in this situation? They'd probably smack someone in the head. Please don't. Point. Ow! I didn't touch him. Call me a wise guy. Nyah, 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 nyah. Okay. Come on. Oh, it's right there. I've got just a handful left. Oh, come on. Whoa! Yes. All right. I got, both of them. I got both of them. I was counting on it not falling and then me getting it on the next one. I bet you were. If it's stuck, you're out of luck. Don't hit the camera, please. All right. Wow, you hit all the cameras. I did. All right, got my plus three, and I got my leaf. So we got four added on. All right, now I've got five leaves. My turn. Well, there's still a plus three on the left, packing that race pretty close. Yep. I used to, after the hot summer, that was really a nice break. Your turn. I bet. In Florida. I actually prefer the spring to autumn, but autumn is just a nice thing. Now, Florida, you don't really have it. Playing on the left. Well, you still get, it's... It's got a cool off. It cools off. Yeah, you wear, you wear a jacket anyway. to school in the morning and you carry it home in the afternoon. That was yeah. pretty much winter. I mean, we'd have, sometimes you'd have a little bit of a cool off. And if it managed to snow, like one flake of snow would fall, literally one flake of snow. You blinked, you missed it. They'd send everyone home from school early. Snow day. Unbelievable. Well, see, when we moved to Florida, it was winter time. Oh, there was a nice cold. And it was snowing in Georgia, which it doesn't, they're not used to a lot of snow in Georgia. And people didn't know what to do about it. So they were doing things like taking their garden hose and rinsing the snow off of their driveways. And so, hold on. Do I get a push? Do I get a no, push? You're done. Oh. You are good. So people were, like I said, they're spraying water to get rid of the snow, which worked great, but all that water would freeze. So everything, we drove through Georgia, and literally, the state of Georgia was a sheet of ice. It was horrible. And we got in a big car accident. That's was, really scary. It was really bad. So because there's no equipment to deal with snow, nobody knows how to drive in snow, nobody knows what you're supposed to do with snow, it makes sense that one flake of snow would fall in Florida. That's your push, John. One, literally, one tiny micro flake of snow would fall in Florida, and they would declare an emergency and send everybody home from school. And I thought it was ridiculous, but when you think about some idiots could start spraying the highway down and turning every street into a sheet of ice, it could be a very dangerous situation. Now look on the far left. It looks like a table and chairs are set up right there. It does. There it goes. One of the chair dice. We'll be talking about it. It's like we're all sitting around at a, at a table having a little chat. It is a jumbo dice. Playing that left. We've had so much snow in the Midwest. I thought 
had gotten it in my lifetime fill of it, you know. But living in Florida, you start to miss it. And the closest we would get to snow, really, is if it was a really foggy day, you get that kind of white, muffled experience. That was as close to walking to school in the snow as I ever got after we moved to Florida. I'm, I'm playing on the right. You got really used to the Florida weather when you were there, right? Well, the first winter, the first year that you're in Florida, you sweat. You sweat terrible. It's horrible. And then, like, your blood thins. They call it your blood thins. And you get acclimated. And then you can handle, you can handle it a lot better, the humidity and the heat. And it's John's turn. All right, here I go. Going across the back. You know, I put, I made stacks of five dollars each, of more than three hundred dollars. Well, more than three hundred dollars. I want almost three. And we haven't even got. 25% out that we put in, I think. No. Well, there was a lot of quarters in that tower, in the tree. I am playing on the left. Hey folks, if you're still watching and you're new to our channel, please give us a like and consider subscribing. Oh yeah, you want to subscribe because you need to get that alert button. Because sometimes John just randomly says, hey, let's do live stream. Let's do live stream. And it'll just be like me building towers or something. And, and we get to talk with people. It's or, nice. Or we'll play a coin pusher game live and give away a mystery bag on live stream. It's a lot of fun. It's We'd love you to join us. Fun. But please, at least give us a like. It's free. It doesn't cost you anything. And it means a lot to us. Hit that like button. That's the only way that says we need that feedback so we know... Okay, people like this one. Or, uh-oh, people didn't like that one. Never do a stuffed tower again. That's people right. sure didn't like that. No. In fact, one of the reasons we're doing this is our last stuffed tower video has 100% likes. So yes. we said, let's try another, let's do another, another game. Let's do another one, see if people like it. The last one we did, oh. oh! Was suggested by... Silver Strike. And it's the Royal Flush. <laughs> Royal Flush. And, uh... This popped out while you were up there. Oh, it popped out while I was up there? Is it mine or yours? I'm not sure. I I'll was take under, it. I wasn't minus, sure. It's I don't know if it was mine two. or yours. I'll take it. Because it could have popped out when it was my turn. I will have to go to the instant replay. And look at the loot cam and see where it came out. It's your turn. Because I'm not sure. That's okay. We'll just we'll just okay. ask for it. If it turns out that it was yours, we'll just and you win. We'll just put an asterisk. There we go. Just like the big one. Yes, it's hard to go to the instant replay when you're filming. And right. in fort, where did the rake go? The rake is under the plus three. I think. Oh. I know. Insult to injury. Oh man. So the whole thing, actually, you won't get plus it'd three. Like, it'd be like somebody giving you a kiss and poking you in the eye. That's right. Okay. I'm going to play on the right. Wow, John is actually robbing the loot cam. There's a bin on the floor of all the loot that overflows the loot cam, and John's robbing it. And I got a little push coming, I think. Oh no, it's a rider. All right. Your turn, John. Here we go. Well, I'm gonna play left. There's those three leaves over there. I'm gonna, and there's three dice. Oh, Big nice push. Oh, that minus uh, one is teasing me there. You got a jumbo die, John. Sweet. I almost have enough dice to play Yahtzee. Yeah. And that's a game we've thought about playing on a live stream. Not quite sure how to do it yet. Sure if you've got game ideas and rule ideas, let us know. We love playing viewer games. Oh, yeah. Like like this, 
I mentioned at the beginning, this is a suggested by a viewer. And uh, they're my favorites to do. Then it feels, I, my, what I really want is I want this to be like, not just our channel and people come and watch it. I'd like it to be like everyone's channel. You got a jumbo dice too. participate. Ooh, I got a jumbo die. John's turn. All right. Here we go, working on those three tokens on the left and hoping I don't get that minus one. That would not be nice. It's moving the wrong way though. Uh, come on. I want that minus one to stay there. Uh, <coughs> Alright, I'm gonna flush my throw and stack them. You got a leaf. I got a leaf? Oh, leaf. cool. Alright, Sherry, your push. Okay. Playing on the right. So far, all my leaves are brown. I'm not picking very good leaves. Well, I'm a negative leaf, so. But you at least got a pretty leaf. Yes, that's true. Here comes my push. Oh, that negative one got left for me. Sure, sir. All right, I don't know where to drop. That negative one's making me nervous. I'll just do some gap fillers here on the left. Time for some rapid fire. Oh, oh that landed on me. I got the negative. So I lost. Whoa! It's raining out that, so I lost one of my leaves. It crumbled. Okay. My turn. I'm playing left. Ooh, nice push. Let's see what we get here. Another oh, little push. push. Hold it, do I get some more? I do. It's raining out the loop. And fan. it's your turn, John. All right. Keep working on the left. That's where the game stopper piece is, and most... In fact, there's no more penalties on the left. All the penalties are on the right. Yeah. Those trolls were sure mischievous today. And they sent just one of their minions. Only one troll showed up. Well, every time I hear a bang, I worry that it's the troll hole activating. I'm playing on the left. Ooh, that was a push. Oh, another nice push. Hmm. Where, oh, where can my little rake go? Where, oh, where could it be? It's right there under the plus it's three. under the plus three. That's where it is. Well, where could it be? That's not a very good rhyme. We don't know that this leaves that are current home. Yeah. Not really. We only have one deciduous tree, and that's nothing to write home about. I'm not complaining. Uh, me I'm, either. I'm a fan of evergreen trees and pine trees. Well, and small shrubbery. Tree. I like small shrubbery. Oh, bring me a shrubbery. And yes, that could be an interesting game series as well. I'm just not sure how to do it. Shrubbery? Search for the Holy Grail, Monty Python. Oh, yeah. Okay. Hmm. I'm going to play right in the middle. 
if possible. There's a silver stick in there. Oh, I get an extra turn. You do. Due to trolls. You figured. Let's the roll. Trolls. Sharon Dillard, <laughs> happy troll day. Okay. Sharon gets a bonus turn. Oh, they're just jumping out of the loot camp. Yeah, they are. You can see the look on Sherry's face. She's giving me that. Oh, don't make me reach down there. Oh, man. Hey, you got a leaf. I got a minus two. I get one oh, leaf. Oh, no. I get one leaf and I get a minus two. I'm what still the negative. Heck? Well, there's that one we don't know about. It could very well be mine. It probably should be mine because it was underneath those Bitcoins or whatever. I think it should be mine. Oh, where? Oh, nice push, Tom. Oh, that rake is, is out there. One negative plus the game stopper and a whole lot of leaves. Hmm. I'm playing on the right. Oh, that's a close. There's another bush. Get another push. Oh, there you go. One. And looks like it's your turn, John. All right, here we go. We'll work on that left. I'm pretty well in the lead, even if I take that minus two. So, just want to get a couple more leaves out of here. Something that's not brown. Yeah. That's the next leaf that's set to, to jump out. It's probably gonna be a brown one. I have a yellow one and an orange one. I have really pretty leaves. And you have some pretty leaves. I'm in negatives, but I have some pretty leaves. Maybe they were infested with insects and I couldn't turn them in or something. That's always fun. A dog ate my leaf. Oh, this one's a bird. got John all set up to get leaves over there. Did you ever have a my dog eat my homework moment? No. I never Me did. Either. But we did have a my dog eat my cell phone moment. We did. And a dog eat my glasses off my face moment for our son. Yes. When Mac first got glasses, he came home and was, I think he fell asleep with them on one night. He was exhausted was that day. day yeah, the day he got them. And Cricket <laughs> went up on the bed and took them off his face and ate, and ate them. Well, 10 years earlier, when Marina got her first pair of glasses, she went across the street to the neighbor's house and their dog jumped up, pulled the glasses off her face and ate them. What are the odds? That happened twice. Um, playing on the left. Cricket actually is visiting right now. Be warned. Hello, Cricket. If you're not warned that she's here, you could theoretically slip on her. Because she very quietly just kind of stays right behind you. She's smelling out those trolls right now. She is. Here comes my little push. John's turn. He's probably going to get three more leads. That's probably what's going to happen. Yeah. But I like getting leaves. You know, I mentioned the catalpa trees at my uh, grandparents' house when I was a kid. The other th cool thing that was at my grandparents' house was uh, they had a bunch of very sandy soil all around the house. And ant lions love to burrow in and make their little trap, antlion den traps. 
I had to catch the antlions. It was fun. It's still your push time. Okay, my turn. You just dig them up and put them in a can and take them home. And then you like feed them ants and other little insects. And you see the insects fall in and try to climb out. Oh. And the antlion would throw sand up at the ant and knock it back down in and then grab it with his pinchers. I got leaves. Oh, you got some leaves. I got an orange leaf, a brown leaf, a yellow leaf, and now I believe I'm in positive zone. You are. And if one of those minus twos turns out to be mine, you might actually be in the lead. But the funny thing about antlions is antlions, when you find them in their little dens or their, their burrows, their traps, they're actually a larva. They're not fully grown. When they're fully grown, they pupate and grow wings and fly away. And they look very different. But the antlion stage is really cool. Interesting. Your turn, Sherry. You know, he's talking about sandy soil around his grandparents' house. A lot of people don't realize that where we are is actually high desert. You see all the, the fields, and you think, wow, what a lush place. It's lush because it's irrigated. If it doesn't snow, real bad snow. Well, yeah, that's, that's, it's out in the valley where we kind of live in uh, Boise proper. And your turn, John. The Boise proper was always very lush and green in that area. That's why it was called Le Bois, because... Well, that's where the river is. Right. There's just so many trees. There's a river running through it. Working on that plus three in those leaves. And, uh... If the rake comes out, it's all right. I'm in the lead, but I could not. I might be behind, so I need I need to get that plus three to guarantee my win. Hey, it's, there's a leaf on the floor. Hey, I got a leaf. It's mine. Is it? I'm claiming it. Okay. All right. I finally got a leaf. It's like real leaves. You look down, and there's just, hey, look, a leaf. It is. I'm playing in the middle. To get another leaf. Yeah, this is actually turning into a little bit of a game here. And am I gonna get a push? Oh, I got a rider. Well, there's still a little push. Nope. John's turn. All right. Keep working on that rake on the left. And folks, I hope everybody's having a great day today. want to thank you for being you and waking up today and doing what you got to do today. Thank you. November. It's a great time to be playing a leaf game. It is. Well, and you know, November is right because it's burr in November. November. Yeah, the end of November is burr. It is. And December as well. Yes. Of course, we're ignoring September and October. It can be chilly in October. September, well, not so much. Yeah. Am I going to get a push here? Oh, here comes a push. And I'm kind of moving into the middle area. Another push. And hold it. Another push. Wait, I might get more. Nope, just fill the gap. Your turn, John. Yeah, you can really see those tokens just floating on the top over here on the left. They'll kind of start moving up that ramp, and then they'll fall back down. And you might think that lip is set really high, but it's on the lowest setting without removing it on this machine. So it's not really There's that a high. Little bit of a, of a raised lip yep. on the edge of the shoe. And when you go into a casino or an arcade, they like to set it. No, super so it's super high because then they don't have to do it, give you any payout. Also, 
You'll notice on the left and right of the play field, there are some silver flanges sticking out. Those are the owner return slots, but ordinarily there's an open hole underneath those. The length of that metal flange would be open. And that's how the owner gets back a portion of the stuff that's in the machine, the quarters and the prizes. That's how the owner would make their money. But since this is our own machine, we block those off so they don't interfere with gameplay. Here comes a push. I might get another push. Nope, John's turn. All right, rapid firing on the left. Working on that plus three. Oh, there's a there's a leaf over here on the right. I'm gonna go after that leaf. Got it. I didn't even see it over there. It snuck up. Hmm. Of course, another brown. Where is my leaf? Looks like all the brown leaves are John's. Okay, I'm playing in the middle. They are. Let's see if we can get this stuff moving. I'd like the plus three to move, not the rake so much. The rake can just stay put. I've got to make up some leaves here. And comes a little push. That's it. That's all I'm getting. Oh, your turn, John. All right, here we go. My five. What just fell? Something fall? Nope, just a lot of quarters, huh? He put a troll on the coin slot. I tried. Okay, trying to be in the middle. Oh, oh I'm getting a push in the wrong area. Yeah, you don't want that minus. No, I got enough minuses. I've got all the minuses thus far. Push. That's not true. I got a minus one. Oh, big whoop. I and got, then minus two is up in the air. We're I not got sure. two minus two. Yeah, that minus two is up in the air. We won't know till we go to the instant replay. Working on that plus three and those last two leaves. We might be able to get them out of here without that rake falling, which would be really cool. It would be. Oh, this is still your push, John. Okay, my turn. Playing in the middle. We got another fresh order of coins from the mix today. We have so many quarters, it's ridiculous. We're going to be building some more interesting structures here. Too. We kept running out of quarters. And... Is that it for my push? That's it. That's it. John's turn. All right, here we go. Working on the left. And go. Rapid fire. Big push. Oh, the plus three and those leaves slid the wrong way. You got a big coin. Woohoo! That's not part of the assignment. I don't get credit for bitcoins. No. I turn in a bitcoin, the teacher says, well, that's not what I assigned. Okay, my turn. I'm playing in the middle. You know, a quarter actually falls. But nothing happened, John. Okay. All in. Okay, what am I gonna get? That was my old five. 
Wait, I think I have another little push coming. The danger's on the right. Another little push. And it's John's turn. Oh, there's a quarter that is holding on. All right, I am going to play left. If we can get that Bitcoin out of the chute, we might make room for the rake and the plus three to start moving that way. There's definitely movement in that direction, and it'll carry those pieces over with it. Yep, that's what's happening. Now, if the lead, when the rake comes out, nobody gets any points for it. It just ends the game. Okay, I'm playing leftish. I want that plus three. If I know I'm, you do. It's going to be mine, though. Well, I'll stop playing over there if the rake gets too close to the edge. Until it does, I'm going for it. And tiny nudge, John's turn. All right, turn. I'm going to play across the whole board. There's that minus one on the right, but I'm going to keep working on it. I'll play the whole board here. Moving everything forward. If we can get some good pushes right in a row, we might be able to move those pieces out before it uh, they slide backwards, but probably not. So the rake is advancing. Is it? Okay. He's playing in the middle. Well, looks like they're going on the left. But I'm playing in the middle. It's just kind of doing what it wants to do. And a little push. Anymore? Nope. John's All right, here we go. Working on the left. And now the middle. And it stays the center left. That's. It does. Explosion. Boy, imagine the fun if that happened on a live stream. That would be pretty cool. No. Okay, we're in the middle. There, they're actually falling in the middle. Yeah. Oh, there's a serious push. Oh, well, you're advancing to three. That rake is moving and left. Hold it, hold it. Oh, those are going to ride. Your turn, John. All right. Dropping in. And here we go. Another big drop. Oh, no. I got it at minus one. I got it at minus one. Still my turn, though. I really need one of those leaves now to make up for it. I'm not way ahead. We are really, this is close. Hmm, okay. This is your push turn. Okay, I wanna see if I can get this orange leaf to drop. Get that movement. Really. It slipped did backwards you see on it you. Slip I did. It way back. Oh, you're trying to. It was to trying to cooperate with you, and then it said, nah, no, nah, nah. No, Just like Dennis Nedry in Jurassic Park. No, nah, no, nah, nah. uh. Nah, uh, nah, uh. Nah, uh, uh. But boy, that could be another series of videos. The Jurassic Park. If someone could draw dinosaurs. Someone can draw dinosaurs. Thank you. Someone can draw dragons too. Okay. Wow, that orange leaf shoved itself all the way to the edge and the back of it. And this push. 
Oh, that rake, is, I think the rake is going to fall out before we get into the leaf. I'm not trying to make it go. They're rolling that way. They're rolling. I think it's just what's going to happen. All right, here we go. Want to get some more leaves so my collection can be complete. I don't oh. think I have an orange leaf. I have a yellow, orange, brown. I have all the colors. I think. Oh, here comes another push for you, John. Okay. I've got brown and one yellow. I have the full rainbow. And a bunch of negatives. Another thing that's kind of cool about the fall around here is uh, during the fall, for us, we always know it's fall because we get a, a special visitor shows up Your turn, every John. year. As long as we've lived where we live, even though we've moved houses, we get a visitor shows up right as the leaves are going to start to fall. And that visitor is a flicker. You can hear the flickers come down from the mountains. And uh, they have a very unique call. And as soon as you start hearing the flicker, you know fall is here. Summer's over. The mountains are getting cold and they're, they're coming down. Uh, a flicker is in the woodpecker family and it is a beautiful bird. It is. Just beautiful. Google it. It's just, it's just wonderful. Well, we have a, we have a water fountain for the birds, and the just flicker, a little one. It, it's very small. Nothing fancy. It's just a grocery store model. In fact. Yeah, it's like you know half, half a oh. gallon of water or something. It's really small, but we are able to keep it heated all winter, and the flicker it comes and drinks from it in the morning. That's really cool. Oh, I got another little nudge. John's turn. And it's got to be really hard on those flickers because they're big. Yeah. But they always come down in the wintertime and or in the fall. They showed up kind of, we thought were early this year, but we always think they kind of show up early. Well, it's always a surprise. It because is. It, it's still. It'll still be pretty darn warm. And then there's the flicker, you know, well, that's it. And sure enough. That the break next, is almost out. The next couple of days, this cold snap moves in. And summer's over. The flicker knows. I'm playing on the right. Let's see if I can get a deck of cards out of this. That'd be cool. So I can't now. play on the left. If I play on the left, I'll, I'll get the rake. And that's the end of the game, and I am not in the lead. There's a push. Push, 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 push. Wait, I think I might get some more. Nope. John's turn. All right, I'm going to go ahead and play across the whole face. Oh, board. Is that so? Yeah. Well, I'm not sure how to get those other two leaves out. I can play in the middle. I'll play in the middle a little bit and we'll see what happens. See if we can get some of those leaves to move. You're getting a lot of quarters in this ball. It's next getting game, ready it's for the next like video. Trigger. Trigger, yeah. Okay. I'm going to play it close. Across. And a push. Here we go. That's my whole five. Can you see what I get? A little push. Am I going to get any more? Wow. Your turn, John. All right. Here we go. Playing all the way across is not good for me. Oh, deck of cards are down and they're lodged in the chute. 
stuck here out of us. Just like in real arcade, it doesn't fall off the shoes. That's right. All right, that's I'll my five. Show the carnival guy, hey, hey, my prize is stuck. And he goes, it's not your prize unless it's in your hands. Push. Oh, just a nudge. Come on, quarters. Be nice. Oh, that and right move. Comes oh. a push. Comes a push. Oh, it's moving. It moved. It, moved. it rotated. It's that rake, you can see it far on the left hand side, that red token. That is the rake. Let's see if we can get the rest of these leaves. You know how you can tell that that's a rake? There's a picture of a rake on it. Oh, it oh, just fell. Game over. Game over. And, and the viewers at home may not have been able to see that because it was on the far left out of, out of shot. So here's the rake. Okay. I have one, two, three four, five leaves, but I also have minus two, so that's three leaves, minus two, so I have one leaf, one lonely leaf. John's turn and to I tell us what he's got. I have three. Actually, I should, I should do that up here. Yes. Yeah, three. Shows it better down there. Four, five, six, seven, Eight. It does show up better up there, but... And then two minuses, which brings me down to six. And even if Sherry's minus two counts for me, that would bring me down to four, and Sherry so would be I three, win. so I, she, I would still win. Yeah, I lose. Okay. Mystery bag question of the day. Who's Sherry's favorite stooge? Ouch! That's oh, that's going to be a tricky Ouch. one. Who is Sherry's favorite stooge? We talked about that really early. We did. And this was a long one. Well, thanks everyone for watching. If you haven't subscribed, please do hit that notify button. Smash that like button. Please do. And we will see you again next time. Be healthy, be safe.